WFNN. The Tiger Financial News Network. TFNN Headline News Update. Good morning, everyone. Basil Chapman on this fourth day of October, Tuesday. We're looking at the Dow in this uh, Tiger Financial News Network 10 a.m. market update. Up 727 at 30,220. Very good move because it's over. Finally, it is over the uh, black 14 period exponential moving average. It's done that before when it had those four fantastic sessions uh, back in early September where it now went from 31,182 all the way to 32,000. Was that 500? Yeah, 504 on the 12th of September. And that was it. Dreaded H pattern as it failed the next day, came smashing down, took out the support level and kept going down to 28,715 on Friday. Now this is really important because there's a chance that we're going to be making a V-shaped pattern. That's what you want to see. A V-shaped pattern with two strong candles, maybe three, but two definitely you want with a gap. If there's a third gap tomorrow, that's unbelievable. But in the meantime, the day is young. We're up 761. Let's look at the S&P. Also, the S&P is up. Dow's up 2.9%. Uh, the S&P is up 2.8% uh, and uh, up 105 in the in the uh, S and P at 37.83, up over the 14-period moving average of 37.54. That's near-term support. Now you're looking at the QQQ NDX 100, uh, very strong move up today, up 3.26 percent, up 8.90 at 282.44. Also just above the 200-period moving average, making the pink 277 level nine-period moving average key support. You're looking at the IWM. We'll talk about that in my show because I was asked about that. In leg B, the others are in leg A. This is in leg B. It means it's already started its move back at 163 uh, a week ago. And that is a, that's a good sign. We'll talk about it when I get back. It's up 5.80 at 175. Gold, is gold giving back some? Nope, gold is still really strong, up 21 at 1723 with silver. Silver up 0.46. At 21.055, you're looking at the dollar pulling back. The dollar is down 67 ticks at 120.99. Crude oil, ha, crude oil is having a very strong day. It's up a dollar 80 at 85.42. The TLT bonds, eh, bonds are just kind of stuck up 38 uh, ticks. I'll be back for the Tiger Technician's Hour. I hope you can stay. Check out my opening call, my daily newsletter. See you in a moment. Basil Chapman, Tiger Technician's Hour coming up.